Big Cartel dropshipping tutorial. Hey guys, welcome back. Today we'll be taking a look at Big Cartel and how you can use this platform not only to create multiple different stores, but how you can even establish a different form of a dropshipping store on Big Cartel. So let's get into it. Now, to get started, simply head on over to bigcartel.com. You guys can see with Big Cartel, you have a free version where you can sell upwards of five products and you don't need a credit card. You can add a single image per product. You have free customizable themes. You can sell online. You get real-time stats. Then, although this is a great way to get started with the dropshipping business, it can only work with very specific niche stores, like stores that are only selling, you know, those trendy TikTok products and you only have like th two to three products, then it's fine. However, with any business, later on, if you want to expand, you can go with their next version starting at $9.99 per month, where you have no listing fees, you get access to over 50 products that you can upload, you also have five different images you can add per product, and you have all of the basic inventory features, sales features, and tax features as well. So let's get into actually building our store on Big Cartel. So to get started, simply head on over to bigcartel.com and click on sign up on the top right. Or you can just click on open your store on their homepage, then click on sign up for free on their platform plans. So you can choose the free one or the premium one if you want. So you guys can see you're just going to enter your email address, a password, and you have to make sure... So once you add your email address, you will have to verify it. Let's just go on ahead and verify for a big cartel like this. Click on verify your email address. And once your email address has been verified, you will be able to see your dashboard. Now in your dashboard, you have your products. Now with your products, you can click on import product and you can import from a CSV file, but you can just click on add a product over here and you can enter your product name, description, category, and all the basic information. Then you have discounts and orders as well. Then you have your basic account. Now in your account, you're going to find your payment and tax settings. So if you scroll down, you will be able to see how you can get paid. You can click on set up payment options because this is probably one of the most important sections. Uh, you will just connect your PayPal account or Stripe account to get started with your payments. You also have your basic store design. So you can see, I can click on the design over here. And currently we are on the default Luna theme. This is what it currently looks like. I can click on the pages to see what pages I have. I have the home page, the product, the contact, cart, and maintenance. And now let's go back and, cause I haven't created, you know, brand images yet, but Let's go back and now after that you have your basic taxes, you have your billing, and you have your shipping profiles as well. Now you might be wondering how can I make this a drop shipping store? Well, the reason I recommend using Big Cartel for a niched out store, uh, especially if you're looking to sell those niche products that are available pretty widely on TikTok like those exfoliating gloves or any of those items, you can simply head on over to AliExpress and copy your listing and you will have to send out your orders manually to your supplier. However, the thing with Big Cartel is that it doesn't make your store look very uh, dropshippy because currently whenever you look at any of the product links for these dropshipping stores, they are very easily recognizable. So you can go on to AliExpress and you can just search for any of the trending products and take like three products in the same category. We have these exfoliating gloves and then you can also add exfoliating. You search for exfoliating and you're going to find a similar product. So we have, you know, this dead skin, electric dead skin remover. Uh, you can sell that. And for this, you will have to just click on the listing. And then you can just add the listing and then you're going to manually add the information to Big Cartel. When the order is going to come into you, you're going to place the order on AliExpress with the customer's address. And uh, what you're going to do is you're going to prepay for that order and then you're going to receive payment from your customer. Uh, so you can obviously, if you're doing PayPal, you're going to receive payment from your customer first. Then you're going to place your order on AliExpress directly to the customer and the customer will receive it. 
Now, if you want to do warehousing, that's totally up to you. A lot of people are doing warehousing for dropshipping products that they're getting off of AliExpress because it just provides you with the ability to deliver products faster than anyone else, which can be a great pro when uh, comparing products, when customers are comparing these products. So if I was to add a product, how would it appear on my Big Cartel store? So, so let's just add a sample listing for something like a exfoliating glove that we are going to buy from uh, a third party supplier like AliExpress and then we're going to sell it on our own Big Cartel store. So for that, what I'm going to do is I can select this and another great strategy is to create print on demand products and you can use uh, Teespring or any other platform to create those products and what you're going to do is you're going to provide a empty slate for your customers to create the product from. So you can create something like a customizable t-shirt on Big Cartel and whatever design the customer sends to you, you can just send it to Teespring and via Teespring, you can send the product back to your customer. So this can also be a great way for you to create products like that. That can also be a form of dropshipping. Now, after that, you can add multiple different categories. So let's say it's going to be Let's say this is a hygiene related product. This is a active product and the price is going to be $30 and then you can add multiple different variants. So it could be color variations. There could be a variant group. Uh, so let's say we want to create a group name called color and within color we have pink and blue. And now I would just click on done. And now two variations are available, pink and blue. Now, after that, you can enter your shipping information and your tax category. But this is how simple and easy it is to add your drop shipped product onto your big cartel store. Now, you can also provide discounts on products just to increase your sales. Uh, and it's especially helpful with drop shipping stores that you provide initial discount. Now, what do you do to improve the overall health of your website when there is so much competition in dropshipping? Make sure you don't look like a dropshipping store. That's the biggest tip I can give to anyone. Simply because of the saturation that is present with dropshipping stores, uh, it's going to be very difficult to get your store to stand out if there are so many other stores that are looking just like it. So let's open the store that we currently have. Obviously, this is currently not live. We're going to have to wait for a couple of seconds for this to be completed. And you guys can see this is like our current listing. I haven't added any images, but it just creates the automatic section. You have variants as well. You can click on add to cart. The store is functional and you can get started with a dropshipping store super easily and super effectively. So I hope you guys found this video helpful. Make sure to leave a like and subscribe to our YouTube channel. And if you have any questions or queries, make sure to leave those in the comment box down below. I would love to help you guys out and I will catch you guys in the next video.